Uh, hey, thanks for joining me on it for a new video. Okay. <laughs> I asked you guys to reply to my tweet with a picture of yourself because I wanted to publicly degrade you, much like Onision does to teenage girls, uh, because it makes him rich. I mean, he's rich as fuck just for being the biggest mentally unstable fucking troll on the planet. He's abusive and weird, and it's impossible to tell when he's serious and when he's acting, or if there's really no line between the two. I, I, do, per I do honestly think he's, he's unhinged. Um, in a lot of ways. But the fact of the matter is, I don't care how fucked up he is, he's rich as fuck. So what is Leon gonna do? Leon's gonna start judging some fucking young teenage... Boy, I can't even say it without feeling awkward. How do you, as a grown-ass man, I think he's like 30, I think he's in his 30s, right? How the fuck can you ask teenage girls to send you pictures of themselves and judge them publicly how can you do that without feeling so fucking vile and weird about it? I just, it's fucking, whatever, it makes him rich, so here we go, it's my turn. Oh, also, there was 165 responses, which is fucking insane, you guys are legends. So I'm not gonna be able to, get, I can't go through all of these, obviously, so I'm gonna pick a couple and do my best. Before we even get started, I took a quick glance through some of these, and, and almost every single one of you is just a disgusting mess. I mean, let's be honest, you're all gross, and clearly uh, there's some work that needs to be done, and I think it needs to start with cleaning up your diet, because you all look like you're fucking diabetic, and your arteries are fucking shit. Coming out of the gate strong with this one, um, all around looking good, but you're wearing I'm Alex merch, so you automatically lose, zero out of 10. Okay, Punk Tuck, I was gonna go with a three to start out because gross, but this move right here. Yay! Bumped you up to a six out of 10. Well done, my friend. You look like you could blow away in a light breeze. I wanna fucking hit those weights, bitch. This is just erotic. There's no other way around it. When you put an Indian girl on the toilet fingering herself, that's, I mean, easily nine out of 10. Beard game bunts it up. Bunts? Ugh. Freudian slip bumps it up to to a to a 10 out of 10 just, just tremendous one of the only ones in the group uh, That didn't make me throw up. It's a sick camera phone. You got there, bud This whole fucking picture is about 18 pixels total Get that fucking shit out of here <laughs> Oh Jesus uh, This honestly doesn't even look like a a picture of a person that looks like a thumbnail for a 1000 degree knife video. I mean, can you, somebody get a fucking fire extinguisher? This house is burning down. Ginger Heat, I give you a fire out of 10. Oh my God. Now this is a girl right here that knows how to get herself a man, okay? I mean, let's be honest, this, Sabrina, you got it going on right here. I mean, the hair scrunchie and the cobalt cobra chins technique, 10 out of 10, hands down, so far the best. I'm adorable, not bad. I mean, the Doge filter game is on point. The spaghetti strap tank top, I mean, could be a little bit nicer. Maybe something like a garment from TJ Maxx. And uh, the pupils look like Oreos, though. Like, I feel like you're coming off of a weekend of doing ecstasy in a room by yourself, listening to old Zed records and blasting yourself with a black light. This is definitely a front runner uh, as far as a picture I'm gonna use for the thumbnail, though, because, I mean, come on. I, just, I shouldn't even have to explain that one. That's obvious. You know, it's funny, Pig. I couldn't think of a good letter letter grade or like a number grade out of 10 to give you so I decided to ask Google reverse image search for some help uh, and pictures of Casey Neistat came up so I give you a Casey Neistat out of 10. Nose. Slept pretty bad. Lol. Fell asleep at like 3. Irrelevant. But you got the doge filter so you win. The lighting fucking blows though. I mean the graininess in this has given me a headache. Step up your selfie lighting. It's, it needs to get better. Crypt Daddy, I was initially gonna mark you down for a little bit too much wrist action in this one, but uh, you made up for it because you let somebody tag a dick on the side of your stomach, so that's a, that's a 10 out of 10. What the fuck is that? What, what is that? Did you, is that a DIY cut holes in your fucking armband glove combo? What the fuck? You look like you start the day smoking crack rocks and then end up at a fucking weird Scientology Bible study late at night. 
I can't, I can't even, I can't grade this one. You look like your mother used to win belly flop competitions when she was pregnant with you. <laughs> Initially, I was very excited about your score because in my opinion, pepperoni nipples are uh, the future, but the fucking resolution is so low that it's one of those pictures that gets smaller when you actually go to open it, so you fucking lose. Fuck off with your shit image quality. Nick, brother, I like the whole scene we're doing here, but what's going on? What's up with the single roll cuff? on the dress pants, that's like late 1995 TJ Maxx. These pants tell me two things about you, Nick. Uh, number one is that you wear hand-me-down clothes from your father, and the second thing is that the last time you saw a tit in real life was on your last day of breastfeeding. Got him! Drinking bleach, I know your meme game's tight. You get a pass. My man. The bleached hair tells me I'm edgy and fresh, uh, and the impenetrable bond with your cute kitten tells me that you're sensitive and will probably die alone, and that, to me, is a combo worth fighting for. You get a 10, my friend. What's Bobby G, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> this man has potential. Strong, flush, redness to the face, uh, says passion to me. Uh, looks like... Looks like he'll spend most of his 20s having no fucking clue what he's doing with his life, and, uh, if he's, if he's lucky, might end up as some sort of D-list YouTuber uh, in his 30s. Rosacea tomato face on point, brother. <laughs> Welcome to the family. We all know what they say about chicks that wear chokers, right? I mean, they all just love to stick huge d**ks up their ass and then marinate in a tub full of Christmas hams. Yeah, I don't, it's, whew. I'm, I'm, I'm all right with it. Pepsi is for the birds, brother. Replace that shit with a beer, and you might get my motherfucking approval. Leon, did you just uh, promote underage drinking in your video? You're fucking right, I did. I'm just kidding. Please wait till you're 21, and please don't delete my channel, YouTube. <gasps> Nigel. When you Nigel, we found your dad, Nigel. But you don't succeed. I can't handle that John Scarce used to look like a Jehovah's Witness serial killer. So one thing I've learned tonight is that it makes me feel extremely awkward when girls ask me to judge them on the internet, but I'm gonna have to get over that because if I wanna get rich like Onision, I gotta learn to just let go of any sort of moral compass or, or morals at all uh, and be able to just tear young, impressionable uh, girls apart for the, the viewing pleasure of everyone else. So uh, this was kind of my kickstart to that. I didn't tear people down too much. I know I kind of dropped the ball when it was in the heat of the moment and I was looking at the picks. <sighs> I need to get better. I just need to be more callous, more stone-hearted. And I'm hoping that practice makes perfect, right? Because I need that fucking YouTube ad rev. And you better fucking believe I'm using Emma Dorable's cleavage in the picture for this thumbnail because... Because cleavage means clicks, you fucking idiot. So I appreciate you guys participating on Twitter. I'm trying to make more content for YouTube and I'm trying to figure out how to do that. So I'm kind of experimenting with different ideas. Uh, so I hope you hang on for the ride. And if you don't like it, you can lick the underside of my... And if you don't like it, uh, just do me a favor and bitch about that to your mother. Because I'm not trying to hear about that fucking bullshit. Thank you so much for watching this video. There was an overwhelming response to that tweet, and I'm very grateful for all of your participation. If you could just do old Leon a favor and go ahead and just, oh, gently press your pubic region up against the like button just enough so it flips blue, uh, and go ahead and leave a comment down below. I don't give a fuck what it is, but it helps with the algorithm, and Lord knows I wasn't able to make this video 10 minutes, so I need all the views I can get because the ad rev's not going to be that great with just one pre-roll ad. Uh, but anyways, I love you guys to death. I'll see you soon.